friends, welcome back to the channel. Today, The Sims rolled out a brand new patch and guess what? Loose teeth are back. Let's go. This patch re-enables the loose tooth feature from The Sims 4 Growing Together expansion pack. With much wiggling, pulling, and twisting, those several pesky tooth issues have been yanked right out. If y'all don't remember the last time, your Sims pretty much aged into amorphous clouded blobs. It was terrifying. So much so that they had to pull the plug on it and remove the feature entirely from growing together. Our Sims mouths have healed wonderfully, and the over 9 million recently created infants will once again have these next stages of life to look forward to. We appreciate your patience throughout this dental visit and wish you many simoleons under your pillow in the morning. Sim Guru Ninja. Let's go. We also have several other bug fixes from the base game. An issue that was causing subtle adjustments to the appearance of Sims in the April 18th update has been resolved. So any of the potato face squishes, the small eye squishes, that has finally been resolved. You may have noticed this issue affecting the appearances of things such as Sims' eyes, teeth, and facial structure. Any Sim that was created prior to the April 18th update should return looking as they did before. Any sim that was created between the release of the April 18th update and this update will have minor adjustments to their appearance as a result of them now being correctly rendered. So if you did not do anything to circumvent this bug that was in the game, your sims will go back to their normal appearance now. In growing together, the chance for a child sim to experience losing a tooth has been re-enabled, obviously, as we just learned. A child sim's skin material will no longer become corrupted after the loose tooth buff expires if the child was already missing two front teeth. All they really wanted was their two front teeth. A teen sim skin material. I wish that they wouldn't call it skin material. It's grossing me out. It's making my own skin crawl. My own meat suit, okay? A teen sim skin material will no longer become corrupted after the loose tooth buff expires. You get to decide how to corrupt your sims, not lose teeth. Awesome. So no more potato faces, no more shadow abominations. Loose teeth are now back. Win-win all around. Thanks, sims. Make sure you hit that subscribe button for more sims for news videos, and I will see you soon.